the Orange Democratic Movement Party maintains it is not part of the Kenya Kwanzaa government, despite the inclusion of four of its members in the broad-based government. And as NTV's Brian Mushiri now reports, a section of leaders, including Party Secretary General Edwin Sifuna, have deferred with Chairperson Governor Gladys Wanga, who in a recent statement seemed to side with President William Ruto over the tussle between him and his deputy Gashagwa. A section of leaders drawn from the ODM party have once again come to the defense of the party, despite four of their colleagues joining the cabinet under the auspices of the broad-based government. We in ODM must remain a pro-people political party. We must remain to the cause, true to the cause that we set upon. Mama Aida, you know I am your child. Mimi nikikosa, nikiona simu ya Mama Aida. Nikiona simu ya Mama Aida, najua nimekosea. So far she has not called me in five years, which means I'm doing well. Aja nipigia simu. Kwa hivyo nikisema kitu, nasema kitu na uhakiki. Mimi kama katibu mkusi tawacha chamachetu kipote. Hatuta tema bigiji. <laughs> ODM must remain a strong, distinct political party founded on the principles of social justice and democracy. Speaking in CIA, the leaders hit out at President William Ruto's administration, saying it has failed to deliver, indicating that they only came in to rescue the country. Na tume, tume, atukatai mambo ya kuokoa serikali ya wili ya mruto. Lakini sisi tunamini kutoka kule kisi. Ile ndoto ya watu wa Western Kenya, watu wa Nyanza, kuleta kiti ya urais katika eneo ya Western Nyanza, bado ijatimia. Na itatimia ikiwa sisi tutabaki kwa watu wa ODM. Come we stay is what even I've seen in my party. My party has gone in, they call it broad base. Near call it come we stay. They've taken four people from my party for come we stay. But the main thing is the rest of us have not gone into come we stay. We are still here as O B M. This is a party we have suffered for for too long. Their sentiments come barely a day after ODM chairperson and Homer Bay Governor Gladys Wanga defended President William Ruto in the ongoing tug of war between the president and his deputy. Brian Moshiri, NTV.